all right thank you for joining me so today on this video I'm just going to be um, kind of summarizing some uh, some information that's out there for I, I would says you know I would guess here changes that um, we're gonna see in the future at some point I mean this these systems are in place we have the you know elemental sprite the, all that stuff so I don't see why we would not get these changes at some point but I mean when who knows it could be like next year sometime who knows when this stuff happened we haven't had an update in eight months in EST that's like a ridiculous amount of time I'm, I'm very frustrated with that part of it as you know just the situation of not going you know go so long without an update is just just crazy but um okay I'm just going to um summarize some of this here I'm gonna have the links in the uh, description for the you know people that sharing the information number one if you are not subscribed to Zuni's page you need to do it she is definitely you know putting in effort and sharing this information with everyone so you know it's out there the community should definitely you know follow her and just give her some um some props for for uh, you know sharing information just just uh show that appreciation uh so that's that and then um uh, so that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna just draw this out, but we'll, we'll get started. Uh, we'll get started here. I think that part is going. All right. So as we see here, we she was already shared previously months ago that they're going to be gear for your elemental sprite. So that is something that you can see on her page. <coughs> I'll put the I put the uh, link for that video below. So there's that. All right. All right. So all right. So next. So along with the um. <coughs> with the gear uh you know the elemental sprites will have at some point uh there is going to be a another item they're going to add to the uh, pet box event where you'll be able to get this skin for your elemental sprite and what that what that skin will do it will add a pretty much a hologram projection of your elemental sprite you know while he's you know while the uh you're in that that burst state so as of now you know we just see our little you know sprite pop up and you know he does he does whatever animation during it but that but see as you see here he has the fire elemental sprite up and now you see like a hologram of the uh, elemental sprite above his above the character's head there while the you know while he's in that burst mode so that's something that they're going to add to the uh the pet pet box event so that'll be coming up at some time So that's that. <coughs> okay, so in this video here, uh, Zoni has really, uh, really sharing some uh, really great information to know. Uh, so at some point, the game is actually going to finally go past level 100 after what two two years <laughs> of level 99 being the max. So. Uh, Zuni is sharing some really great information here. They're gonna, there's gonna be a level 100 gear dungeon. Uh, it looks like it's gonna be some um, really grinding going on for that level 100 gear because it's, it's like all the work that we put into this gear that we have up to now, it's pretty much gonna be for naught. It's pretty much gonna mean nothing. Um, from what I'm looking at here, uh, from her video. Uh, let me go ahead and start this here. Um, of course, she'll show at the moment that they're going to open up 100 here. Uno dolor de cabeza porque pues aparece un nuevo equipo, verdad? Un nuevo apartado de equipo para mejorar. Y pues sí, queridos surcacielos, el nivel 100 es un hecho en la actualización, en una actualización recientemente que ha tenido la versión original de China. El nivel 100 ya está habilitado para todos los jugadores. Como bien mencioné por ahí, eh, la puerta lunar ya está activa. All right, so that's that's like kind of just the image that shows. So she's going to show a run of the level 100 dungeon. I'll, I'll skip forward to that so you can see a run of it. Um, yeah, I don't, don't want to take away too much of her thunder here. So let me just kind of get to that. A ver right, so cómo es este calabozo que por ahí muchos hemos querido ver. Entonces, pues aquí se los mostramos. As you see, some people there were already level 102. So, um, 
and I'm guessing they also have that new rank for uh, you know Beyond God King that's going to be coming up so if uh, if any of my you know subscribers out there if you can uh, you know if you <laughs> I'm sure I have quite a few that uh, know Chinese so if you could definitely um, <laughs> let us know what that says there uh, under his picture for the the rank then you know what the next rank is going to be <laughs> Beyond God King <laughs> But this is the dungeon they're running for the level 100 gear. And there it is. So there you go. You see that, that they got the level 100 gear. Um, so I'm going to just skip forward to the next part where she's just kind of talking about the, um, you know, the gear itself. Um, but I'm, I'm just going to summarize that. Uh, you know, of course, just letting you see what I see, and then, uh, like I said, I don't want to give away all of her thunder here because she's really going into detail and talking about things. So you got to go to her page to get the full description. I don't want to, you know, just take all of her all of her her shine here <laughs> now one thing one thing i will say that that i feel is going to be a problem with this level 100 gear is it looks like we're going backwards in far of, of you know as far as customization i don't see an option to convert the stats you know how we currently on our our red gear we can convert the stats i didn't see that as a as an option here which that's a step backwards in my opinion i mean we're already at a point where we can you know have more access to our gear being able to customize our stats so now taking that away and forcing us to farm new gear that is that seems real problematic i don't, I, I mean that that is uh, uh, i don't understand why take away that functionality from us when everything is when there's so much rng in this game as it is but Okay, I'll let you just take a quick look here. Pequeñas imágenes por ahí de muchos equipos de nivel 100. Como ya había mencionado, por ahí salen todos los cofres, al igual que las llaves. Y otros por ahí recursos que pues estarán apareciendo al alcanzar el nivel 100. Y como les había mencionado, por ahí los diferentes cofres que estaremos obteniendo mediante este calabozo, los tendremos que abrir con llaves de igual manera que estaremos obteniendo en este calabozo, pero también podrán ser compradas mediante diamantes, eh, hojas de plata, hojas doradas o entre otras tiendas que están por ahí. Y actualmente para mejorar el equipo de nivel 100 prácticamente tiene la misma función que si como mejoráramos cualquier otra parte de nuestro equipo. Prácticamente por ahí nos estará pidiendo cristalitos de dragón y hojas plateadas que conforme vayamos evolucionando este equipo pues obviamente nos estará pidiendo otro tipo de cristales para mejorar pero pues esto no tiene nada que ver con que sea nivel 100 simplemente es como si mejoráramos cualquier otro tipo de equipo ok so as you see here clicking on the, on the red gear there's no option to convert stats you only see two options nothing that i would assume here that says convert stats and then also as far as enhancing the gear we're starting that whole process over i mean it, it was a pain in the butt to get this level 90 gear you know maxed enhanced and now when you're going into the 100 whenever we get to that 100 phase you're starting that all over again major pain in the butt but it, i'm just you know you, i'm just showing you what i'm what i'm seeing and 
and that's it so i'm gonna stop the video here and i'll, I'll put the uh, links in the description definitely go go by zuni's page you know give her a subscribe you know thank her for the work that she's she's doing here and and that's it thank you for watching